As this huge mixed tag team match gets underway, let's not lose sight of the fact Liv Morgan promised a larger-than-life A-list movie star, and she brought out The Miz? How many movies have you starred in, Cole? I think The Miz is a great pick. A multi-time champion, and he's in current fighting shape. The captain's partner's a big-time star for sure, but he might have to shake off some ring rust. Oh, man! Ouch! Nice running crossbody. Left hook in the mush. Close line! What impact! John Cena's fired up and wants this crowd to know it. Look at the power from Cena. Face first. Taking this match off the mat now. Cena, you gotta be kidding me. Took a leap of faith and connected perfectly. This could be just what they needed. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Oh, ouch! The Miz isn't really looking like a glamorous A-lister after absorbing that blow. Cena not showing any signs of backing down here. Unloading with that power offense of his. <laughs> nice running crossbody. Cena is showing zero restraint. Cena is showing that trademark ruthless aggression. Defends off the attack. Short clothesline. Devastating elbow. Elbow drop. Piercing. Watch the precision with this strike. John Cena feeding off the WWE Universe as he so often has. Ooh, that hurt. Ball and a punch. Cena gets intercepted. Now Miz looking for some momentum. Yeah, he's able to stop that surge dead in its tracks. And Miz now finding himself on the wrong side of momentum. Miz has to devise a new plan here. <laughs> Looking to finally put Miz away. Cena. Look at this power. Onto his shoulders. Altitude adjustment. Does Cena put this one away? This could do it. Cover. But uh -huh. the teammate makes the save. And just in time. Cena still divisive as ever with the WWE Universe, but you can't deny his legacy. Close line. Good Lord. So effective. And Cena is in command. Cena is certainly getting that fierce look in his eyes. From the apron. Oh, the way to the outside. Gentlemen, in the interest of self-preservation, I may have to excuse myself. Saxton, you hang tight. Let this play out. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Uh. Boom! Face first. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. He is looking to do some serious harm. Double ice handle smash. Good defense. Reversal on top of reversal. Counters on counters. Technical prowess on display. Neck breaker. Quick thinking pays off. And he's already taken more hits up there than he... Cena powering up his opponent into position. Mia's telegraphing that one. With a neck breaker. Nice running crossbody. He tags out, so now the women are going to go one on one. Ooh, look at her answering back. Running knee lift. Reversal. 
reversal from Morgan. And misses on the springboard. This is not going to be good. Relentless. And to the corner now. Oh, not a good place to be. Series of kicks in the corner. connects and she has an answer for Liv man what a slam Liv is really out of it she might be done soon winding up there's a Samoan spike ouch Liv is completely out of it Nasty right hand, vicious in Zagari. And now Liv is under immense pressure. Yeah, Liv's defensive instincts need to kick in. Nice running crossbody. That's gotta be it. Two. Finally, it's over. Here are your winners, Green and John Cena. The brightest superstars in WWE history just put Liv and The Miz on the D-list, as in defeated. That was a miscarriage of justice, and you know it, Saxton. Cap and John Cena are part-timers who do nothing but steal the spotlight from superstars who actually put in the work. So, miss, big time deal. The so-called captain took the chance to ride someone else's coattails again. Hooray. Congrats. You better believe if I ever partnered with Cena, I wouldn't make him carry our whole team. Of course, I would have had that opportunity if it hadn't been so viciously taken from me by someone whose priority in WWE right now is transitioning to part-timer. But maybe that's why you got into this industry in the first place. As a stepping stone to something else? The last time it was just me and you, Cap, you got lucky. That won't happen again. So I'm ready to end this. Once and for all. You and me. SummerSlam. You've got your big movie, your big talk show, your red carpets. If you're so hungry to leave WWE for Hollywood, I'm happy to help. Fade in on a dramatic, big picture ending. Loser leaves Raw. I may be a star, but I also want to be here. You? I'm not so sure. Oh my goodness, this all has been so incredible. What? First, a dramatic confrontation and comeuppance on your talk show, Captive Audience. You didn't even see Liv coming. Then, 
after your one-on-one -on -one battle with Liv Morgan, freaking Cena gets involved and shows up as your partner! <laughs> oh, I can't even imagine what is going to happen at SummerSlam. Wow, you're really into this, huh? I know! And once you win, imagine all the others you can conquer. Week after week, you, you face a new formidable foe and engage in battle to prove who is stronger, smarter, and more powerful. Uh, Alfie? Uh, yes? So, I gotta ask, had you ever watched WWE programming before you started representing me? Honestly, okay, no, I was just struck by your cheese talent. I started watching more recently, and it is awesome. The stories I've seen rival any Hollywood production, and you put your bodies on the line for real. I told you from the start that I knew you had something special. I was right. I'm surprised you're so into this. I figured you'd want me to use this as an excuse to leave WWE so I could move on to the next big thing in my career. Next big thing? This is the next big thing. Facing Liv and dominating the entirety of the WWE women's division. Don't worry about Hollywood. I'll keep the offers rolling in once you've accomplished everything you need to hear. Really? Of course. As your agent, I'm supposed to guide you. No way I would let you leave all this behind. <sighs> Though we really should talk about that 10% you owe me. Sorry, Alfie, gotta go! The lights can't be brighter and the stakes can't be higher.